Yeah, there's only a surface. There's nothing inside. Is the sun actually, do you believe, combusting in and of not burning anything. There's no fusion in the sun. That's well understood. Prove it. Yeah, well, there's just not the way to prove that there is any. It's only in the flares that you get fusion. That's where all the x-rays. The flares, the arcs, and the x-rays, and the microwaves, and whatever result of fusion in the arcs. It's, there's no fusion in the sun. They don't know how the sun works. Why do you... What's special? How does the sun make... Well, it's a transformer. It transforms from some other dimension. It's not burning anything. It doesn't have to. It's a converter. Of what? I don't know. Nobody knows. But that's what it does. That's the only thing it can do because that's how everything works. Transforming from another dimension. Yeah, you could say it's taking energy from another dimension, counter space. There, there's no energy, actually. You can't, most of it you can't even measure in outer space or see. Can't see. No, you can't see the sun in yeah. free space. So the sun is not visible in outer space. Not in free space. It's only invisible when gross matter becomes involved, like the Earth's atmosphere and envelope and the surface of the moon or whatever. That makes the light. Otherwise, there is no light. You can see the moon, you can see the Earth, but you can't see the sun or you can't see the stars. But you can see the planets and yeah. the satellites. Right. You can see material objects, but you cannot see the sources of light. There is no light. So there's a material object. To reflect off. So that means there's no time delay. So the whole time delay thing is, is meaningless. It doesn't take light years. There are no light years because there's no light. So that, that, that means that the light you see from the distant stars isn't four million years old. It could be only minutes old. It could be instantaneous. All the theories collapse when you can't see the stars in outer space.
get up. I know you're out there. I can feel you now. I know that you're afraid. You're afraid of us. You're afraid of change. I don't know the future. I didn't come here to tell you how this is going to end. I came here to tell you how it's going to begin. I'm going to hang up this phone, and then I'm going to show these people what you don't want them to see. I'm going to show them a world without you. A world without rules and controls, without borders or boundaries. A world where anything is possible. Where we go from there is a choice I leave to you. <laughs> 